Good morning, Arts Impact Middle School artists and staff. Today is Friday. We've made it. That's right, we've made it to Friday, and it's the first Friday visiting artists, even though technically this is the second Friday of the month. I get that. And we have a packed day today. So let me start with reading our Artist of the Week and Panther Pride. First, Miss Corinne nominated Mally Woods Law, for Mally has created wonderful choreography that is now our class dance. She's also very hardworking in dance and practices until she gets it right. Way to go, Mally. I can't wait to see that dance performance in May. Emma Roop was nominated by Mr. Waddell for being the number one scrub on 7.1. Just kidding. She's awesome, and she better come out for track. He also nominated Joseph Gomez Reyes. For Joseph turns in all of his work and has a great sense of humor. He can extra at times, oh, he can be extra at times, but is pretty good at figuring out when he needs to get his focus back. And Dariana Hodge, who is focused, she does an excellent work in class and has a good attitude. Now, Dariana, I need you to keep that up, okay? Now, Miss Mitchell, our newest CCA, was nominated for jumping right in and doing an amazing job. Welcome to Ames. Miss Bentley and Mr. McKee nominated Nizon Kesaba. For Nizon is crushing it in math class and out of math class. He is silent and always solving those equations. And they nominated Amari Scott. For Amari's hand is almost always raised in our class. I can always count on him to try his hardest and answer whatever questions comes his way. And then Alexandria Fields. For Alexandria has really turned a corner and been participating in class a lot. She raises her hand and puts herself out there. Keep it up. Miss Grin nominated Nakaya Robinson, for Nakaya is always ready to go and do more. She has consistent positive energy, and she's a leader in the dance class. And back to Mr. McKee and Miss Bentley for Jane Ado. For Jane has 100% of her work completed with five days left to go. Way to go, girl! And Kimani Padgett, for Kimani is a hard worker with all turned in for this quarter. All work turned in this quarter. Awesomeness! And Aiden Miller, for Aiden is a go-getter when it comes to his work. All done. Keep it up, Aiden. Mr. Waddell nominated Nolan Cotter for fixing his attitude and being a game pro. Mr. Peace was nominated for being a rhinestone cowboy. Uh, Justin Jenkins was nominated by Mr. Waddell for beating Jay Sean 3-0 in the basketball series. Show and prove. Ms. DeVoe nominated William English, for William has been working hard to keep his grades up. He demonstrates maturity that he continuously checks to see if his grades are top notch. He's not satisfied with average grades and always tries to improve his grade. Ms. Fiddler was nominated for Keep Rockin' in the Free World. And then back to Mrs. DeVoe. Wow, she nominated like 10 students. Amia Hunter, Daria Wright, Daria Wright Mudlow, Nakai Struthers, Hawa Nadoro, Liam Cox, Zalani Moorhead, and Cora Leonard. These students did a great job on their argumentative essays. They used their resources to produce super essays that rival that of high school students. I'm so proud of their hard work. And then last, Miss Parrish nominated Jamila Coleman. For Jamila has definitely won the award for most improved Spanish student. This quarter, she's turned in every single assignment, done incredibly well in all of her quizzes, and abdicated for herself whenever she did not understand something. She has worked so hard to earn an A, and I'm so proud of her efforts. This week in particular, she has crushed it with interrogatives. So congratulations to all of those Panther Pride and Artists of the Week students for this week. Uh, I am so honored each and every week when I get to read this list about all of our students and staff that are being their best at the arts each and every day. Now today, I know that Miss Jones is taking 40 of you to a fantastic Friday um, right at Columbus State. So you have that field trip. Artist of the Week will be again at one o'clock, we will call down our principal cabinet representatives around 1245 so that they can get paired up with their artists and take them to class. Um, we have five days until the end of the third nine weeks. So do you have a 75% at the very least in all of your classes? That is correct. All four cores and your two arts classes get that 75 percent all right so five days we can crush this let's make it through this fabulous friday calm bodies focused minds balanced emotions and as always arts impact i ask that you are your best at the arts by achieving showing respect demonstrating your talents and making safe choices each and every day